What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a great general collective reading for all signs, caps, suicides, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Free general collective reading. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. We're at 13,350 subscribers, so thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash out, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to, to donate. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart chakra. Um, oh, and if you um, want to share the videos, uh, I'd appreciate that, too. Single mom with two kids, so it really helps support a single mom with two kids in one of her income streams. Just saying, just saying. Um, for ever, just a little quick little update, my court date is was on Friday, but it has been moved. Uh, it's to be announced, so I'm not sure when it's going to be yet, but I'm just updating everybody and letting everybody know. Um, I don't know when it's going to be yet. I guess we'll see. So it was supposed to be on Friday, so we'll see. Um, Okay, so I received a channel message, another one. They're just rolling in tonight. Rolling, I mean, coming. Um, I will probably start um, filming the cooking channel tonight. Um, I, I don't know when I'm going to upload it and all that. My daughter's going to help me edit it and all that first. Um, it's a little different than this. I can get on here and just click it on and boom. That's different. So um, I don't know when that'll be uploaded, just to let y'all know, okay? All right. So the channel message I received was um, someone from your past that stole money from you is about to try to come and offer you a very, very, very large expensive um, item soon. It would not be smart to take it um, because they are about to be under a huge investigation for theft from you. That's what I heard. Uh, some it's a family member, some it's an ex-coworker. Okay, someone's a family member, someone's an ex coworker. Um, someone's an ex lover, someone's an ex lover. So you plug it in how it resonates. So, whoever this is for, of course, these are psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages. One may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. You have to plug the message or messages in, how they resonate, and apply for you. Okay, only you know your situation and story, not anybody else. Uh, okay, so somebody from your past, some it's a lover. Of your past so you had sexual relations with them in some shape form or fashion lover energy for some it's an ex co-worker so you worked with them in some kind of workplace dynamic in the past and for some it is a family member but i'm assuming a strange family member a strange family member a strange family member okay so for some it's an um, ex co-worker of the past for some it is an ex lover for some it's an estranged family member of the past I heard soon they're going to try to come towards you to offer you, and they want to offer you a very large, big ticket item. I'm feeling for some it could be a vehicle, for some it could be a, um, a vehicle, I mean large ticket items here. I mean, we're not talking about no little gift card or a gift basket. I'm thinking a vehicle, uh maybe like an ATV or a motorcycle or um, or maybe a home for some. Um, heard a big ticket item. For some, it could be an expensive vacation. I mean, you plug it in how it resonates, but some kind of very large big ticket item. But I heard it's from money they have stolen from you in the past. So it's your money that they bought this off of, but they want to look like the good guy, basically. Um, I heard it would not be smart to accept it because they're about to be under very heavy investigation soon. Some, they already are. For some, they already are. So for some, they already are under investigation. For some, they're about to be. I heard it would not be smart to accept um, these large ticket items. Only you know who these people are and how they apply in your life. Only you know if you've been, whoever these people are, I don't think you communicate with them right now. I think you have blocked them out of the, your life or they have blocked you. But now... Since they have stolen money from you, now they want to come and make it right, but make it right on your stolen money. Someone is getting a huge ass wake up call. Huge. Someone is about to return stolen money to the police very soon. Someone is getting a huge ass wake up call. Huge. And someone's about to return stolen money to the police soon. 
So you plug in and how it resonates. Um, it might be one of these people that, um, I don't know. But somebody wants to come towards you, buy you something very large and expensive to make them look like the good guy. Narcissistic activity all over the place here. But it's off your stolen money. So that's crazy shit right there. But somebody's getting a huge wake-up call about to return stolen money to the police, so that's good. You plug it in how it resonates. They should have never stole it to begin with. And that's just the truth. Some of these people are already under investigation. Some are about to be. So you plug in your own life how it resonates. They should have never stolen your money. And that's just the truth. These people are in for it. These people are in for it is what I just heard. These people are in for it. Some kind of large ticket item. Like I said, I gave you examples of what I think it could be. I think it could be a vehicle. Um, maybe a home for some. For some, it could be like a motorcycle or ATV. For some, it could be uh, expensive jewelry, possibly, like a diamond ring or an engagement ring, or if it's a lover of the past. Um, for uh, What else could it be? Um, whatever a very large ticket item is, and how that applies, okay? But it's off your freaking money, man. It's off your money. That's narcissistic activity at its finest. But somebody down here is getting a huge wake-up call, and they're about to return stolen money to the police. So that's a good thing. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. Um, only you know if you connect in with this specific specific story and situation, not anybody else. So you have to plug it in how it resonates. But they should well, they should have never stolen the money to begin with. Returning it to the police would be the smart idea. Not trying to woo you with large ticket items off your stolen money. And that's just the truth. Here I just you have a Privileged lady reverse. Gift reverse. Number 12 or 17 can be very significant numbers in one's life. 12 or 17. Okay. I was making sure it wasn't, they're, they're not all reversed. Privileged lady reverse. They put you in a state of lack for a very, very, very long time. These are very narcissistic people. It would not be smart to re-communicate with them. Okay, I heard they put you in a state of lack for a very, very, very long time. It would not be smart to re-communicate with them. So they left you as a privileged lady reversed in a state of lack. But it's because they stole your money. They took to took from you when it was your money. and But now they want to give it back to you in the form of a large gift as a gift, but it's your money that they're buying it with. That makes no sense. No sense. I heard um, they're very narcissistic. So they put you in a state of poverty. I heard for a long time, they gave you no gifts, no love, no emotional support, nothing like five of pentacles energy being left out in the cold for a long time. I heard years. For years, for years, they left you in lack. Years. With, off of, and it was your money. But now they want to come back and be the good guy. Privileged lady, reverse, gift reverse. So this is them leaving you five of pentacles out the cold for a long time. But now they want to come back and act like the good guy. Basically. Then we have despair reverse, number 32. It could be very significant number in one's life, number 32. They want to silence you. And blackmail you with the gifts, but it's about to backfire in a huge ass way. They want to silence you and blackmail you with the gifts, but um, it's about to backfire in a huge way. So they want to silence you, keep you quiet, basically, and blackmail you with the gifts of your freaking stolen money. But I heard it's about to backfire. In a huge ass way. In a huge ass way, I heard. Holy crap. So despair reverse. For some, it's a lover of the past. For some, it's a toxic family member of the past. A strange family member. For some, it is um, a co-worker of the past. You plug it in how it resonates. Despair reverse. Hold off. You're about to be very, very, very happy. 
through many shocking series of chain of events. Okay, I heard, hold off. You're about to be very, very, very happy through many shocking series of chain of events. So the spiritual download in this is hold off. You're about to be very, very, very happy through many shocking series of chain of events. So hold off is the spiritual advice in this. Do not accept the large big ticket items from these people. Only you know who these people are, not anybody else, whether it's an ex-lover that you were sexually connected to in some shape, form, or fashion, whether it was um, an estranged family member or an ex-coworker that you don't speak with. Um, I heard hold off because they left you in poverty for years, in lack for years. They stole your money for years. Now they want to be the good guy because I think it's ruining their reputation or it's about to. And I think some of these people are under investigation or they're about to be because I've been pulled in a lot of investigation energy today, a lot. So, and I think some of these readings piggyback, but you plug it in how it resonates. I heard, uh, hold off. It would be the spiritual advice in this because you're about to be very happy through many shocking series of chain of events. So this is your energy. Uh, if this resonates and applies for you, happiness over some kind of shocking series of chain events. Distant horizons reverse, 36. Number 36 could be significant. Things are happening so fast now, so fast. And they will continue. Things are happening so fast now and they will continue. So fast energy. Distant horizons reverse um, is fast now. It's in the now. So things are happening now. And they will continue to happen fast. So you're going to be happy soon um, through some kind of shocking series of chain of events. But the spiritual advice in this is do not accept these large big ticket items because basically they're get, trying to gift you these items, gift you these items, but it's your money to begin with. They don't want you to know it's your money though. So you plug it in how it resonates. All right. I hope this helped. Love you guys and namaste.